All right, welcome boys and girls. Welcome back to the YouTube channel. We want to look at our two times. All right. And I want to show you the relationship between addition and multiplication. All right. So two times one equal two. All right. So it's just one, two. All right. But what if you want to find two times two, it will equal to four. What are you doing here? You're adding. So 2 and 2 equal 4. 2 times 2 equal 4. All right. Now what if you want to find what 3 twos is going to be? All you need to do is to add 2 more to it to make it 6. 1, 2, 3. So 3, 2 would equal to 6. And what if you want to find what 2, 4 is? Let's just add another 2, which would make it 4. And this will give, give you what? 8. 6 plus 2 equal 8. Right? So 2 times 4 equal 8. 2 times 5. It is giving you the value of 2 5 times. Alright? So we have 4. Let us add another one to it. 2 again to make it 5. 8 plus 2 equal 10. So 2 times 5 equal 10. What if you want to find 2 times 6? Then we had one more 2 to it, which will give us 12. Alright, and 2, 6 equal 12. And we had one more 2 to it to give us 14. So 7 times 2 equal 14. And we want to add another 2 to it. Oh, we had one more 2 to it. Bring us to 8. 14 and 2 equal what? 16. So 2 times 8 equal 16. Alright, and if you add 2 more to it, 17, 18, you get 18 here. Add 2 more to it, 19, 20, you get 20 here. Add 2 more to it, 21, 22. Add 2 more to it, 23, 24. Right, and 2 times 12 will give you 24. So all you were doing here is just adding another 2. Adding another 2 as you come along. 2 plus 2 plus 2 plus 2 plus 2 plus 2. Plus two. You're adding 2 as you come along. That's the same thing for the multiplication because here you had 1, 2. Now you have 2, 2. Now you have 3, 2. You're adding, you're coming up by 1 each time. So all you do is adding more 2 to it as you come along.